Hello, this is Noseman from the Maxon training team and in today's fantastic quick tip I'm going to show you how to use a field to select which of the children of a cloner the cloner is going to select to use as clones. In this scene I have nine building models going from left to right, the tallest to the shortest. So here we have the tallest at the top and the shortest at the bottom and it's the same as the tallest on the left and the shortest on the right. I'm going to create a default cloner, select all these, make them children and set our cloner to generate 10 by 10 clones. Let me frame this and you can see because the default mode is set to iterate, it iterates through each clone depending on the index number and then cycles around. I'm going to switch this mode to sort and now everything is the first clone we see here. In order to surrender control of the clone selection to the effector we need to add an effector so I'm going to add a plane effector and I want to turn off the position because I don't want to move them and I need to go down here where it says modify clone. When it's zero it selects the first one and when it's a hundred percent it selects the last one. So now with a hundred percent set here the effector strength is going to select each clone. I'm going to set this to hundred percent and then I'm going to go to the fields because I want to control this clone selection using a field. So add a linear field, make it larger, turn off the color unless you need it that is, and let's rotate this around and now you can see that I can move it and control which clone is available by having the largest clone uh, on this side and the smallest clone on that side. And that's how you control which cloner to select using fields. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment, subscribe and enable notifications so you never miss another quick tip.